I think with the uh, events that occurred from the major and the possibility we've, or the chance, sorry, of now being able to move to a new region, it's exciting to be able to pick up players that are like hungry and excited to win. One of the things I always look for in a player more than anything is that they're hardworking and hungry to be successful and this team is full of those people. Literally every single player you can like recite different events that have occurred like being qualifying for a major or being at a LAN event like all of them have had that but they've not had like a team to consistently show themselves. I've been with uh, Dab and King Ardi for a, a long time and I felt I needed a change. The last team there was a lot more of me having to make people do things and try and like push for people to do things that we know are necessary to be a successful team. This team it's like everyone just assumed that that's how things are done. They sort of came in and just started discussing what they wanted to do. In the tournaments and stuff these days the majors when it's GSL format and there's a lot at stake and there's a lot of pressure like you don't actually maybe get to enjoy it as much as uh, you should. They told us that we were kicked before the event. They changed their minds and they told us we're not kicking out until the major's over. So then after we got kicked after India, that was kind of like a kick in the gut. A lot of teams lack discipline. And personally, coming from my early days, I play a lot of real sports and like always like the discipline part. I look up to the like top athletes in any sports, professional, whatever. And all of them have in common is discipline, like work hard, work every day, work together. I played with Misery last year and I enjoyed that and I think we had a we had pretty decent synergy. So I'm just hoping that we can bring the same back in this team. I mean, overall I'm just looking forward that we get to play together. Hopefully we can all learn from one another and then just get better as a team and hope that we can prove ourselves, whether it's in qualifiers or then at the end of the day at Lance, hopefully. I think the end goal is just to play and then see where that takes us, I guess. I think Gunnar is really good and he's a kind of a young up and coming player that has kind of shown himself to be good in his previous teams. I just felt like uh, he might be somebody who can be at the top. I just had a good feeling about him. Milan I looked at uh, for a while. I remember playing against him in qualifier for TI last year and I thought he was very annoying to play against. I just thought he was good and then when he played in J-Storm, he was good. I've been eyeing him for a while, and even after, when he was kicked from J-Storm, I was already thinking about, wow, he's actually a free agent. I wonder who's gonna, you know, who's he gonna play with and stuff. Kesu, uh, I played with last year in TI qualifiers. Very open to playing anything. He's very fast at understanding the game. So I think he has a lot of strengths, and is maybe also slept upon a bit by both the community and just in general. Underrated. Right now I'm just kind of excited to play and to see where this team can go. It's going to be very different and I'm just looking forward to seeing what that'll be like, pretty much. I feel confident and uh, I'm looking forward to play a lot of Dota with this team. I'm excited to officially announce Chaos Esports Club's new roster. HFN K3 will be playing position 1, Gunner will be playing position 2, Kezu will be playing position 3, and Milan will be playing position four. Misery will be continuing as the team's captain and moving back to five, and the ever-level T governor will continue to support the team as coach. We're all really excited for this roster and hope each of you will continue to support us on our road to the international. Thank you.